Welcome. Today, we're going to be drawing a pirate ship in Scratch Jr. Today is Pirate Day, and I want to take you to the drawing tools to draw a pirate and a pirate ship. So, once you get to your home page like this, when you're ready, press the pink start button. So you can see I already have been practicing on some of my projects, but I'm going to start a new project. So I'm going to come to the blue plus button, and I'm going to start a new project. Now yesterday we were learning how to add characters and add backgrounds, but today I want to show you how to draw and use your draw tool to draw your own backgrounds. So we're going to go up to the top next to the ABC, the thing that looks like a little picture, and I'm going to click on it. Now you can see these are the backgrounds that I've drawn. I'm going to choose a blank piece of paper for a background, and then I'm going to come up here to the paintbrush and press that paintbrush. So now I have a blank piece of paper and I can begin to draw my background. So today we're going to be drawing a pirate ship and a pirate ship sails in the ocean. So I'm going to start with drawing my ocean. So I'm going to pick this squiggle tool up here on the top, make sure I have that, and then get this length. You can see how it turns orange. It's kind of the width of my water. And then I'm going to pick my blue that I want for the water. And I'm going to pick this dark blue. And so I'm going to start on the edge of my paper. I'm going to put my finger down and I'm going to draw the waves. So I'm going to draw the waves of the water. Okay. And then I'm going to pick a different color blue and I'm going to draw some more waves like that. And then a different and then this way, my waves will kind of have dimension. So then I'm going to press the paint bucket. You'll find it on the bottom on the other side. And then I'm going to paint all of my water this blue color. So I got the paint bucket, and I'm going to paint all of the water blue. And then you can see the other kind of blue in there, and, and I think that looks really cool, kind of like waves under the water. So now I'm finished with my water and I want to paint the sky. So I don't want it to be white. So I'm going to press this lightest blue color. I already have my paint bucket selected and I'm going to just touch my finger in there and voila, I have the sky. So now I want to start drawing my pirate boat. So a pirate boat's made out of wood. So I'm going to pick the darkest brown. I'm going to come over here to the squiggle line tool and I'm gonna make sure that I have uh, that same width. I think it'll work great. So I'm gonna put my finger down and I'm just gonna draw kind of, a, kind of a half circle right there, just a half circle. So there's the bottom of my boat. And then I'm gonna come back in and I'm gonna draw kind of the top of my boat, just like that. Now, I don't want my boat to show with the water show, so I'm going to come to the paint bucket. That's what I use to paint big things. I'm going to keep my brown color and touch my finger right in there, and now it's all brown. Now, I want my pirate ship to look like it has wood planks, so I'm going to pick my drawing tool here. I'm going to pick the squiggle line tool, and I'm going to pick a light brown, so kind of a lighter brown, maybe even a lighter brown. And then I'm just going to follow the grid along the lines with my finger. I'm just drawing along that line that you see right there. And I think that looks cool. I think that looks like wooden planks. There, I like that. So that's fantastic. Now I need a mast. I need the mast. That's the, that's the pole that holds the pirate, um, the pirate ship the uh, sails of the pirate ship. So I'm going to pick a dark brown color for the wood. I'm going to pick kind of a thick piece of the down here and I'm going to draw the mast like that. Okay. And now I'm going to draw a black sail for my pirate ship. So I'm going to get the squiggle line tool. I'm going to get the black color and I'm going to draw kind of a almost like I did the boat, like that, but that's the sail of the ship. And then I'm gonna use the paint bucket again, 
touch in the middle, and color it black. Now, I also know that pirate ships have a skull and crossbone on their flag, or on their sail. So I'm going to get a white. I'm going to get a little thinner, kind of maybe the middle one. And I'm going to do an X. Oops, I forgot that. Oops, I turned it away. All right, let's paint it black again. Paint bucket, black color, paint it black. There we go. Squiggle line tool, white. There we go. Notice, when I make a snap mistake, I just go, oops. Now, I'm going to try to draw, yeah, there it is, that big X. So, there's the crossbones. Now, I'm going to draw the skull. Just a big circle. Paint bucket. Paint it white. <coughs> so, there's my skull and crossbones. I could even use the circle tool right here with a little black and if I put a little dot my finger a dot with my finger and my line tool I can draw the skull it doesn't look scary but I don't want this to be a scary ship all right so now I have the black sail I think I'm going to draw another flag kind of as a decoration so I'm going to get my wood I'm going to do another sail here this time I want my sail to be white. So I'm gonna do my line tool. I'm gonna draw the white sail like that. Paint bucket, paint it white. And I think I'm gonna add a little red so it can be kind of fancy. So I think I'm gonna do some, nope, that's not what I wanted. Let's paint that white again. I want the red line like that. So red paint, middle line, squiggles. Let's try this again. So I think I'm going to do use those lines again and then just do some lines right down there like that. Maybe even do it around like that. I think that looks awesome. All right, cool. That is a great pirate ship. I'm really happy with that. So now let's go and let's draw a pirate character. So I'm going to do the green check mark. And now, oh, look, I have Dot. Remember Dot? She's not looking much like a pirate right now. So let's go over here to our Dot character and let's press that paintbrush. Now, Let's turn Dot into a pirate. So the way we do that is, it's already colored, but we can change her colors. So I'm gonna do the paint bucket, and I know she's a pirate, so I'm gonna give her a tan. I don't think that green looks much like a pirate. So I'm gonna touch in there, just give her some tan, cause you know, she's been out. And then I think her hair already kinda looks like a pirate hair. So I'm gonna go ahead and choose the squiggle button, the black color, and I'm gonna finish, and I'm gonna make her hair look kind of like a pirate's hat. Instead of hair, it's kinda like a pirate's hat that they tie, kinda like that rag hat that they tie on there. So I'm gonna color that like that. I think that looks great. I'm gonna add some red to that so it looks kind of like a sash like that there I think that looks awesome kind of like she tied it around her head like that I'm also going to give her a red sash I think around her waist that makes her look more like a pirate so now oh I don't like she needs some pirate boots so I'm going to pick the black color with my squiggle line and I'm going to give her some black fancy boots like a pirate. Pirates wear fancy boots. So I'm going to do that. Hey, you know, somebody might want to decide to give her a peg leg. You know, sometimes I see pirates with peg legs. But I'm going to give her just some fancy boots like that. And then I also know that she might have a hook on her hand. So she might have a hook. 
So I'm going to use that brown color, this brown color. And this arm right here already looks like it needs a hook. So I'm going to do it brown like that. Yeah, that looks cool. And I'm going to pick this gray color. And I'm going to give her a hook. So maybe she lost her hand in a pirate fight. Now, I don't know about you, but I don't know many pirates have purple eyes. So I think I'm going to give her some... Uh, what do you think? I think I'm going to give her blue eyes. I have blue eyes, so I'm going to give her blue eyes. So I'm just going to touch the paint bucket and touch her eyes. Blue. Now she has blue eyes. But wouldn't it be cool if she had a patch over her eye? So I'm going to get this thin button, or the thin width, and this squiggle line. I'm going to get my black color. I'm going to draw an eye patch. So I'm going to give her eye patch because I know pirates they sometimes have a black eye patch like they've been on a fight and then I'm gonna tie it on like that how cool is that she has a black eye patch Ooh, she's looking at me all right so now ooh, I think she needs a scarf around her neck I'm gonna give her a yellow scarf around her neck That looks great. Yeah, look at that. Oh, man, she looks awesome. So now I have a pirate. So I turned Dot into a pirate. I think she looks great. You could add more features. You could give her a sword, or you could draw a parrot on her shoulder, or maybe you want to um, have a spyglass that she's looking through. But there's my pirate. So you can add lots of details. So I'm going to press the green check mark, and now... I have a pirate, and she has her pirate ship, and I can go to a trigger block. I can say start on the green flag. I can have her move over. One, two, three. Press that, the home button. Let's see what that does. All right, come on, Dot. Yeah, there she goes. She's going on her pirate ship. I think I'm going to put her back up here on her pirate ship. Then I'm going to start her. I'm going to make that her home. And then she's going to walk her pirate ship. There we go. And maybe I'm going to have her say something. I'm going to go to that. Remember how we found that microphone? And we can say, Ho, ho, ho. No, that's like Santa Claus. We don't want that. Let's get rid of that one. I'll stop that one. How about? Ahoy, matey! Walk the plank. Oh, I like that. Let's play that. Ahoy, matey! Walk the plank. Great. Let's press the check button. Awesome. All right. So now we'll have... Let's see what that looks like. I'm going to end my program, go full screen, and let's play it. Ahoy, matey! Walk the plank. All right. So, have fun oh. today creating your pirate ship and your pirate.